And see, for you and me to access the power of Almighty God, we got to stay what? Connected to him. We talked about last week. If, if you abide, if you stay connected to him and his word stays connected to you, you can ask whatever you will and it's going to be done. But if you're not connected, there's no power flowing there. And you and I need to stay connected to the almighty God. We do have an enemy, do we not? And he does his best to hinder us, throw obstacles in our path. You know what? I, I like to watch those runners who jump over those hurdles. Because you can just imagine you're running and the devil throws a hurdle in your path. And you just jump over it. Keep on going. And you jump over it. And it's just like, wow, look at that guy jump. That is amazing. And horses go over hurdles as well. And it just shows the glory of the horse. There's a hurdle. There's an obstruction, obstacle in its path. And it runs and it just, and you see the muscles and the strength of the horse as he overcomes. And the enemy of our soul would, would throw obstacles in our path. You don't have to quit. You make a choice. I refuse to be defeated. I refuse. I'm not going to give up, you know. You don't stop. You, you, you don't quit. You, you don't give up. No, you just keep on moving forward. Have you been spending time with him? Have you? Refuse defeat and connect with Jesus. Make time for Jesus. Take his promises to heart. Put on all of his armor and stand your ground. That's what I'm talking about.